Nezulu, they say into entle yangwanga. And in English, they say give credit where credit is due. Because there's too much negativity around the chief. See, I lose one game, Sekbang at it's the end of the world. So it's also very important, Uguti, when there are positive things, we also talk about those things. Now, I'm not talking about just so it's Derby because that's like so two weeks ago, but it's something that goes beyond the Soweto Derby, something that was happening even before the Soweto Derby happened. And this thing is, right now under Uzwan, it seems like they are committed into making this project work. Now, I contradict her because I said before, I think against the Mazuluguti, they will lack the passion and the fight in them. There's a difference between the mental strength and how committed you are because you are failing to do things that you are required to do, but you are committed to the team and you want things to be better for the team. Maybe let me make an example for you. Remember when the Chiefs were playing against the Swallows, Uri uh, Frostla was starting as a right back and then Solomons was a bench in. Yet, there was a time where I saw Solomons going to Frostler and he was basically just coaching him, telling him something about something that was happening in the game. And that just warmed my heart because it tells me, Uguti, these players are not just there for themselves, but they are also there to support their brothers. And if a team in Aleon Tole Uguti, we work together, we want to win together. Gang Jabli is Another player who's been a good example of this and people have been talking about him a lot, is Eric Matoho. And I know Ugutu Matoho, uh, personally, Ogu Nyugutu Angadlala no Mangadlala, Sengagbege Saiti Nloko. But in presence, yeah, ke, ama reactions are ke penchi in when the camera, like, ilula ngagubu. You can see Ugutu, Agu Ugutu, he's disinterested. Ugutu doesn't care whether the team wins or loses. But all the time, we are born Uguti, they are worried, they are happy if in All those things just tell me Uguti inside the camp, Uzwane is managing the players because there is the party Uguti Umlali can be good and everything. But if they are not managed properly, if they are not taken care of, if they don't feel loved, then they end up not performing well. And these players are sissies. Why should they be made to feel happy? They get paid. I will tell you what, you can get paid a lot of money, but if you don't enjoy the company of people that you're working with, you might as well they quit their jobs just because they are not happy with their jobs. And which is right now, it seems like if you're going to build, you need to be building with people who want to be there, who want to build and who are committed to the project. And that's exactly what I see. And just, I think, e -e 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 icing on this, no, the cherry on top is thing Uguti, everyone still seems like everyone seems to still know Uguti. They know their worth and they are valued in the team. Take Umshini, for example. I made a video about him. Umshini, like less than a month ago, he lost his father. And he comes back to his squad, Uzo Lala Guisoeto Tabi. The biggest game in South African football. I don't need to say more about that. And he comes in, he performs. You can see what his head is in the right space. And he hasn't played, he hasn't performed so well in previous games. Yet in that game, he comes in and he gives that kind of performance. Now that tells me, Ugutu Zwane or Shepard, I think it would be Uzwane. Had a conversation with him. Good, listen. Go out there and prove how good you are. And God did he go out and prove how good he was. Again, it shows what the immaturity is on another level. But it's also, I believe strongly, it has to do with the fact that something is happening with background and it's making Abadlali Babe happy. And if you're keeping the players happy, well, our results will continue showing up. If the players are happy about the team, if the players are committed to the team, then we are going to see more fight than before. And I'm looking forward to it because because there are things that are written on social media and they see those things. 
but if they are strong enough to stay together and be united then achieve seeing ngempela ngempela is going far thank you so much for watching i will see you on the next video and until next time remember equals alpelo moya